Hi, I, I'm Lei Ying. I come from Singapore. I have, uh, I am 60 years old and a housewife. I have a, a form of retinal dystrophy, which is similar to RP. I have visited Dr. Yu four times uh, in the last two years. This is my fourth time. I come every spring and autumn. And uh, I had, uh, actually my vision was perfectly, uh, not say perfectly fine. I have genetic testing in 2018 and confirmed I have a form of RP. So uh, I wanted to come in 2019. Unfortunately, there was a COVID and I only could come in 2022. Okay, throughout this, uh, okay, prior to COVID and the lockdown, my vision is still pretty okay. I'm still able to travel through computer and uh, almost anything else. But with the mRNA vaccination, and uh, my sight became to become very ver blurry. My vision became very blurry. And uh, it was, um, then I came in for two treatments. But uh, last, after last, the treatment in last September, I had another COVID attack in, uh, infection in uh, November. And that's where I see a very big decline in my vision, even after doctor use treatment. Uh, it was like totally blur. I, I couldn't see very clearly. Uh, so this is uh, come April and uh, this is September. This is second treatment after COVID. I have seen a significant improvement. Okay, this, this time round, uh, I have issues with glare, flashing lights, and uh, light adaptation. So this time round, uh, my glare has significantly reduced, whether it's outdoor or indoor. The flashing lights uh, still remain, but it's manageable, bearable, uh, maybe about 30%. Uh, then I have light adaptation. Light adaptation is actually very good now. Like uh, this corridor which I'm standing, it used to be totally dark for me if I were to come in, step in from the outside. But right now, uh, with uh, like 30 seconds, I'm able to see uh, bright and uh, as what the normal people can see. Uh, the only vision, the only issue left is my blurry vision, which Dr. Yu is trying to correct right now. And uh, I have hope that uh, in my next treatment, I'm coming back next April, <laughs> he will be able to perform some. Uh, uh, magic for me. <laughs> uh, fluctuations is a actually a constant companion for RP patients throughout my um, the last four years where my vision uh, declined so badly, um, and then even when I was experience, uh, experiencing treatment with Doctor Yu, there are very good days. That means which means I can see quite clear. I can see a lot more. There are less flashes. There's no glare. But of course, there are days that you know um, the flashes will come back. The, uh, the glare will come back and then uh, sometimes they say, oh, why is it so blurry this morning? So, uh, why is it so foggy? I, I, this is, I believe, is a part of our, our illness, the disease itself, and uh, it's, it's, it is a degenerating disease. So, uh, you have to take it with a positive mindset. That's what I personally believe because uh, you have to heal yourself, you have to work with the doctor to heal yourself. Yeah. Oh, okay, definitely it will decrease. I mean, RP, as everybody knows, it leads to blindness. It's a degenerative disease. There's no escape from it. Okay, uh, my, my main concern is sight preservation. Okay, anything else is a bonus. So, uh, I have experienced a very bad sight. I have a, a very bad vision. I have experienced good days and all this sort of thing throughout these four treatments with Dr. Yu. And I believe... Um, with every treatment, there is improvement. I, I mean, with every treatment, there is improvement, I believe. And so, uh, I am uh, not so fearful now. I'm, actually, I would say I'm no longer fearful. Uh, at least, I will have my sight preservation. And I do have a lot of bonuses, as in I can see more. I can see, you know, I am slowly regaining part of my lost vision. As I mentioned earlier on, uh, RP, retina, dystrophy and all this is a degenerative disease. It would, the cells will just continue to die. No matter how, as you age, the cells will just continue to die and then of course it leads to blindness. So as um, I, I believe maintenance is very important and uh, I have to maintain because it has proven to me the last four treatments. I have uh, regained a lot of my sight. Uh, even right now when I'm talking to you, I see behind, I can see the trees, the, the, the things that's going on and all this. I feel very happy that there is sight uh, preservation. Of course, um, I want to be greedy to see a bit more, to make, make Dr. Yu work harder. 
but <laughs> maintenance is of course important and uh, coming here once a year is definitely a must even though I have recovered here. Yeah. I love the atmosphere, okay? I, lo I love the atmosphere. In fact, I love this place because uh, everybody is like family. Everybody takes encouragement from each other. Uh, we do see a very um, significant discovery or even I would say miraculous di discovery when we, we see patients with narrow field vision widening and all this. We see patients that, uh, I, I mean I've seen uh, with, with my four, tri uh, four treatments here, I've seen patients who walk in needing the assistance of family members and then um, second and third treatment I see the same we, we meet each other again and then hey this guy is walking independently doesn't need the wife to hold him he knows you know so um, these are all encouragement that uh, uh, and of course it makes it very interesting that the uh, different nationalities come we talk we laugh and then we try to communicate with each other so it's like a global community and uh, the most important part is that you are not alone you feel that you're not alone and uh, you're not alone in the world, you don't have this problem and then there is a doctor here that is able to treat you. Yeah.